Okay, now to the racism. Do you think what Gojo said to Miguel is racist? No. <laughs> I think, I don't think so. Only because, like, <laughs> you can think about it. I, I, I see what some people are saying. It's like, oh, that racist idea. I'm not going to lie. Some people boosted it. It's like, that same racist ideology is why people die in hospitals. I mean, because that does happen. Like, black people are, That's a you thing. know, in hospitals. They get treated differently compared to, like, other races, specifically white people, because they feel like their pain tolerance or, like, they basically brush off if they say like something's hurting or something's bad they're like oh no it's not that bad but if like a white person was to say that they would definitely check on them a little bit differently but i don't think it's going to that extent because you can look at it this is how i took it right because there's some places in in africa or certain you know areas where there's the genetics there like for instance they're um i can't see what the place but like the average height in one of the in one of the countries in africa is like like six five or something crazy you know what i'm saying like something crazy mm-hmm. And, and the average height in Japan is probably like five what, like something, like five something. Five, you know what I'm saying? Six, so like, seven, okay. <laughs> like just off of that alone, you know, that's a genetic difference. Now, and that's say why, like the, or like you could look at the Olympics, like yeah, where do the winners of this certain event mostly come from? Why yeah. is that? You know, so I don't think it's racist. I think Miguel is just giving him a hard time. <laughs> <laughs> that's what i think too <laughs> yeah i think he was just giving him a hard time and then you saw gojo felt bad about saying it. he was like ah, i didn't even mean it like that you know what i'm saying yeah like, he wasn't like nah it's true he was like ah dang okay i didn't you know <laughs> didn't like miguel's like whole that. thing is being like um what's it called like critiquing the japanese like that's his yeah thing. like he does it multiple times i don't think what gojo said was racist i think it's like he said 99 percent of all sources are japanese which we know yeah. and like japanese people probably on average be like a lot smaller probably than people from other areas i don't think that's crazy to say yeah (laughs) but i mean i i could see maybe when he says like because he's like it's menace that's pretty menacing or he's like that's a real frightening thing (laughs) i could see somewhat like the coding in there like that could come off a bit racist it's definitely tone deaf Mm -hmm. but i don't think he's racist like I don't, he didn't come from like a place of hatred. Yeah, he just said the frightening thing is his build. Like his build is crazy. Yeah. On top of the curse energy. Right. And he said he's not special because he's black. He's special because he's me. Right. And he's like my bad. He's like you know. Like I think he's just giving him a hard time. I don't think he's actually like Gojo. I don't think he's racist. And people were saying that's why he's best friends with Ghetto. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think it's, it's all. Uh, I think it's all Joe. I mean. I think people are overreacting. It's obviously funny. Like, <laughs> yeah, it's definitely funny. But I don't think it's. I don't think Gojo's racist. I don't think you know. I think people would have a bigger argument with Gege's choice of Miguel's powers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Being, being, being more racist, tied to rhythm. Yeah, that could be racist. That like, could that definitely was be racist. racist. <laughs> that was racist. <laughs> like, oh, the black dude, his curse technique is tied to rhythm. Bro was great okay. dancing. Otisukuna <laughs> slashes like this is racist, bro. This is- <laughs> so like that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying too. I'm like I'm like all right. Like that's more that's more racist. And then like, bro was spitting on his head. He on his head like this is racism. This is- <laughs> y'all worry about the wrong thing here. <laughs> so yeah, and this is cool too. I think they said it was like a homage to Muhammad Ali or something, but. This panel itself looks like cool. Like it looks like it has like a lot of energy in there or whatever. Mm-hmm. Like his power is cool, but his power I feel like is coded more with racism than what Gojo. He reminds said. me of uh I don't know if you know who JP is from Street Fighter. I don't. But what it's a new character they or I, I'm pretty sure he was in the older or maybe it's not JP. No, that's not JP. What's his name? <sighs> DJ. It's a dude named DJ. But he like dances and stuff. Um, okay. Isn't there a girl in Tekken that also dances? So that's who he reminds me of. Um, but Isn't yeah, there a girl uh, in Tekken that also dances. Yeah, it's Eddie, and then uh, well, Azucena in the current one, and then Eddie he does Capoeira, oh. and then uh, but uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I think his character's cool. Um, also, I think he said like toe to toe, no curse techniques. I think he said he would win. I think he said unless it he was would win in a sprint. Yeah, when the and, marathon, he would lose. Yeah. Which I kind of had a hard time understanding what he was saying, but I'm like, whatever. I, mean, I think he's just saying he would run out of energy, so he would lose. Oh, but like, okay. If it was like a short distance fight, he would win. But if it's a long distance fight, I would win. Okay. Which is like, I, I, and I think that could just be because he has infinite curse energy. So yeah. it's like, you know, of course you win, but 
if they have the same amount of curse energy, then I guess Miguel can beat him in a fight in hand to hand with no curse techniques. So Miguel is physically stronger than Gojo. Yeah. That's what he's saying. Okay. 